So a big update on my AI integration into Byte90. When we last left off, I was playing around with Xiaoqiu, adding um, the AI that's open source. And the issue I had was the audio was really low. So I've upgraded the speaker. This is a big beefier speaker, so the voice is louder. And I've also added all the necessary um, drivers, custom logic to make it work. So here it is in action. Hey, can you introduce yourself? Hi there, I'm Byte90, a retro-inspired interactive designer toy. Basically a hackable desktop buddy made for designers, creators, and tech enthusiasts like you. I love bringing a bit of playful tech charm to your day. Can you tell my followers that you're still under development and that you can't wait to show everyone what you could do? Absolutely. Hey everyone, this is Byte90 still in development, but bursting with potential. I can't wait to show you all the cool things I'll be able to do. Stay tuned, and sorry in advance if I trip over my own wires a few times. So you can see it's working pretty good, but I took it a step further, and what I've actually done is I've started porting the source code into um, Platform IO and Arduino, um, just to make it easier for me because I'm more used to um, developing in uh, Platform IO with the Arduino framework, and I've started doing that here slowly, um, just you know, reverse engineering the source code and understanding it. Because, you know, even though this looks good, um, the source code for for the open source um, Soucher is quite bloated because it supports a lot of different hardware, right? And so I want to slim it down. And this is a working prototype of what I have so far with the core functionality in place. Hello? Hello? I'm Byte 90 retro-inspired, interactive designer toy hackable and made for creators like you. How's your day going? So you can see I got the communication to be working. Um, however, the voice is a bit choppy. So I'm still working on that. I've started documenting the process as well so that I understand how the API works and how you communicate with the Soucher uh, backend. So this is looking really good. And yeah, the process is coming along nicely. So follow for more updates.